Hi guys, um, welcome back to Islamic Stories. I haven't uh, done Islamic Stories in a while, so I'm quite excited. We are, if you watched the last video, you might want to change the video and go back to the last one and watch it because we are right now on chapter two. So, yeah. So, you're starting again after a long time, which is exciting. Okay. You might remember this book. Yeah, this one we're going to read today again. My first Quran storybook. Okay. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. So, the first, this will be a preview. So, this chapter was about the beginning. You can remember that it was nothing, no light, all dark. So, um, you could see the first chapter was the beginning here. Beginning. You can see. And it was a good chapter. And it, it told about how Allah created the world. But now we're going to build on to it and start a new story. Let's start it. Chapter 2. The First Man. In the beginning, there was nothing. Then Allah said, Be. And the world was made. The world is like a huge machine. It runs all the time. It never stops and it runs very smoothly. Just like a factory. It runs smoothly, keeps going. That's how the earth goes. It's good, keeps its big machine. Big. Allah made angels. The angels are very powerful. What do angels do? The angels see to it that all the commands of Allah are obeyed in every corner of the world. The angels tell the winds to blow. They tell the clouds where to go. They tell the rain when to rain. And they record everything that is happening in the world. So they're like... They, they make it rain. They, Allah tells them that, like, like if you want, if Allah tells the angels to make it rain, say, then the angels have used their powers to make the it rain. Or if they want, if Allah wants ask the angel to make do rain, I mean wind. Then the angels were doing it. They're very powerful. When the world was already running beautifully, Allah wanted to make a human being. So he, so Allah, he, he said that is this is a beautiful place, but he thinks something's missing. And now Allah is going to add a human. So Allah collected all kinds of soil. He took dry sand um, and moist earth and sticky mud. You know, the soil? Sticky mud is under the soil. He mixed them all like po poachers, clay. poachers clay. He molded into a shape of a man. Finally, he breathed his spirit. Uh, oh, wait. He breathed his spirit into it. He named the first man Adam alayhi salam. Then he made the first woman who called her Hawa or Eve. We call her Hawa, but she also has another name which you could call her Eve. Allah loved Adam alayhi salam and Hawa. We, he gave them many gifts. He gave, he gave them eyes to see the beautiful world. 
It gave them ears to hear the birds sing. It gave them a voice so that they make, may talk to each other. And he gave them mind to understand what is good and what is bad. Allah wanted Adam Salam, and Hawa to live on the earth. There was one part of the earth which was more beautiful than the rest. It was called the Garden of Paradise. You would call the Garden of Paradise, Jannah, Paradise, something like that. Allah wanted Adam and Islam and Hawa to live in this beautiful garden. You could also call it, um, you know, um, heaven. Yeah. So I guess the chapter is now done. The next chapter will be the pride of Iblis. Iblis is another word for shaitan. Okay. Shaitan is um, a devil. Devil, yeah. Devil. Yeah, so see you at the next video.